St. Thomas is all about the railway. We've been very train centric since way back in the 18, late 1800s. The diesel came in in the 50s, that was a big deal. We've had local churches with train bells in them um, erected. So back in the 50s when they started decommissioning the, uh, the steam trains. So we've had a, a major love affair with the trains for quite a long time. It's only recently really that uh, we don't see many trains through here anymore. They've recently taken out the tracks. The only uh, accessibility of, of our trains to, to the museum itself is no longer there. So I'd like to see some kind of a downtown park where we actually bring the trains out and, and make it a little more focused on that. Because now we're a tourist attraction um, and we need to focus on that and make sure it looks like it's a, it's a tourist attraction. We are the train capital, let's still be that, you know. At one time we were the biggest train station uh, hub, I believe, in North America before they built the Erie Canal. I mean, this place was three times the size it is now. Like, this is a small, sleepy town as you speak, but I think it, at one time the population was quite a bit larger than it is now. Everybody here, the older people all miss it terribly. The young people just uh, missed their jobs, really, when the factory started closing down in 2008. That kind of put a huge damper on the economy here. So, yeah, we're suffering a little bit, but uh, we still take our trains pretty seriously around here. A lot of the collectors of memorabilia and that, and myself included.